I think that for 6,000 years, humans and civilization have done things one way. Blockchain is going to let us do it a different way. And I think that a thousand years from now, they'll be talking, this revolution is going to be bigger than the Gutenberg press, going to be bigger than the internet. It's changing the way humans interact because instead of creating third party institutions, which are corruptible, we are reducing things to mathematics and cryptographically protected algorithms. I think that the fractionally reserved Keynesian multiplied magic money tree financial system we live in is seeing its last days. I think it's all going to crash. And I think that what we are really in the act of doing, we have the crypto world, you and I, are building what's going to be a, a warm standby for, for civilization itself. So when the, the, when the systems were on fail, the central banking and the, and the and the debt-based money and Keynesianism, when they all fail, we, civilization won't be over. We will have this warm standby. We'll do a hot swap using geek language. We'll do a hot swap to these other systems. We'll have a functioning capital market. We'll have a functioning central bank. We'll have blockchain central bank. We'll have functioning voting systems. In fact, I mean, all this stuff will be built. I feel like I'm in a race against time. I've got like, I don't know, what do we have? How, a couple years before the system as we know it starts buckling. Uh, that, that feels about right. Well, it, if, if we can have two years before the system, before we have another 08, we can, with two years, we can build functioning standby systems.